Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to a makeup tutorial. So in today's look, I wanted to do a fall inspired makeup look because you guys have asked me on Snapchat to do a makeup inspired by the fall, which is, I don't know when fall is, but I know that it's quickly approaching, especially here in Utah. It's starting to get cold. Like I've pretty much waved goodbye to summer at this point. So last week I ordered the new Juvia's Place The Masquerade palettes and oh my god you guys, you need this palette in your life. It is so pretty, it is so big, like this is like almost, it's bigger than my head. It is so incredibly beautiful, it's so freaking pigmented, like literally one swatch and you get so much pigment out of this freaking palette. And without further ado, let's get started with this video. What was that? I'm first going to take this e.l.f. primer. I've actually been really liking this so far. Um, you guys saw the disaster when I didn't set it. So, lesson learned. A little goes a long way, so you really don't need a lot. I'm just going to dab this on my eyelid. And then to set the eyes, we're going to take this Sexy Mama by The Balm. So on the eyes today, I really want to use this, uh, The Masquerade by Juvia's. This is a brand that I feel don't, it's not very known here on YouTube and I don't see why not because I have two of the palettes and they are freaking bomb. They're, they're just freaking amazing. So I'm first going to take this color right here which is Zulu and I'm going to be applying this to the crease. Can you see the pigmentation? This is the first time that I'm using it by the way, but like I said, I've tried other Juvia's Place palettes and they're so good. This eyeshadow is totally giving me autumn pumpkin-y fall vibes. So the next thing that I'm going to pick up is I believe it's Otta. It's this one right here. And it is very similar to Zulu. This one has a lot more of those red undertones that kind of matches my shirt. So I'm just going to apply this onto the crease just to make it a little bit more intense. Then I'm going to go in with the MAC Soft Ochre uh, wait, Paint Pot and I'm going to apply that to the center of the lids because I'm going to go in with a shimmery shadow and I just feel like it works best if you apply this first and I'm just going to apply that to the center of the lid and then blend it out. Um, for the center of the lid, I'm going to use Calabar, which is, it looks more of a purpley, reddish, burgundy color. So I'm just going to take this and apply it on the lid. So now I'm just going to go in and draw my wing liner. I like to go pretty thick when I'm doing like dramatic looks. I mean, I like to do it thick either way. And I'm just going to use the NYC Black Eyeliner. So now that the eyes are kind of done, I'm going to apply lashes and I don't know which ones I want to wear. I actually just received a package from a brand called Baddington Lashes and they sent me some of their lash styles to try out. They have this one with a really cute packaging. These are called Kennedy Silk Lashes, I believe. And these are a little bit too natural for my taste, or at least for what I'm wearing right now. 
Um, they sent me these other ones, and I think actually these are the ones that I'm going to wear. And these are Bardo, and these are 3D, 3D Silk Lashes. These are really pretty. They also have Hepburn Silk Lashes, and these are really pretty, but they're definitely a little bit more for a more not so glamorous heavy eye. These are super, 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 super natural. These are ear heart and these are also silk lashes. I don't know if you guys will even be able to see them, but these are very natural. Then the last pair that they sent me are called Harlow and these are also 3D silk lashes. These are really pretty as well, but I think I'm gonna go with the most glamorous ones. And these are 100% silk lashes. They can be used 25 times. They're animal cruelty free, they're lightweight, comfortable, and they are handmade. I will have a link if you guys are interested in these lashes. I'm not sure of the price, but I will have their website, which is beddingtentlashes.com. So let me go ahead and apply the lashes so we can just finish off the rest of the face. So now that I have the lashes on, I'm actually going to smoke out the lower lash line, and I'm just going to do the same steps. I'm going to take Zulu and then Ada and just really like smoke it out. Now for my bronzer, I'm going to take the Kat Von D Shape and Light Palette. This is definitely one of my favorite ones. I've had pan on this, uh, what's it called, Lyric shade. But I'm going to take uh, Shadow Play and I'm going to apply that pretty much everywhere just to bring some color to the skin. For my blush, I'm going to take this one by Jordana. It's one of my favorite ones. It's Terracotta. It is so pigmented for the price. It's just amazing. You guys have to have this in your collection. I want to add a little bit of inner corner highlight. So I'm going to take Giza, this one right here, and I'm going to apply it to the inner corners just because I feel naked without it. For the highlight, I'm going to use this one. It is the Lara, Lara. Laura Geller baked gelato swirl in ballerina this has more of a peachy pink undertone and we're just going to pop this on top of our cheekbones so for lipstick i didn't know what to do so i just went with the ofra long lasting liquid lipstick in americano i kind of wanted to do something that matched the eyes but then the shirt was kind of throwing it off so this is what i went with very pretty pumpkin-y fallish color i don't know what that was Okay guys, so this is the final look. I really hope you guys enjoy it. I really like how this look turned out. If you guys want to see more looks using any of the Juvia's palettes, um, I own the second one and then now the newest one. And as always, leave me your comments letting me know what other videos you guys like to see. Do you guys want to see makeup tutorials? Do you guys want to see like back to school makeup look? Do you guys want to see a transformation? Let me know what you want to see and I will film it for you guys. I love you guys so much. I hope you have an amazing Monday. And until next time, I will see you chicas later. Bye!